All right, guys, I have officially brought you an update inside the new house. So pretty exciting stuff. It's gonna look a lot different. So I'm gonna just briefly talk about everything and take you downstairs into <laughs> the Lego room, of course. But yes, we do have drywall up and in. So it actually came out looking really, really, really good. Obviously we hired someone to do the work. I can't take credit, but <laughs> it looks absolutely awesome. It feels like a home right now. So in today's video, we're gonna be taking a walkthrough update on our current house build where we'll be building our, we're gonna call it our dream Lego house. So if that all is just you, stick around, hit that subscribe button, enjoy today's video. I'm your host, Christo, and let's jump straight on into it. First off, uh, if you guys wanna watch some of the previous updates, um, this is like the whole entire kitchen area, uh, like a dining room kind of area. And then on this side will be our living room space and more living room space with upstairs and then downstairs to the Lego room. I guess we're doing a quick house tour. <laughs> Inside here is going to be a bathroom, a closet, and then your front door entry walkway. And then of course we have a, what is going to be a homemade library that I'll be doing all by myself. Uh, we'll go downstairs in just a minute, but I figured we can walk upstairs really quick. May as well, since we're getting the house tour, we do have a high ceiling, um, like landing pad here on a u-turn staircase i don't know what to call it <laughs> that's what i'm calling it but anyways yep that's uh all looking good we move upstairs i'm gonna go ahead and turn around the first thing you'll have is our gaming room is what we're gonna call it it's going to be a loft area nice little window there and then on this side is going to be i don't know like a Maybe a TV on that side, couch on that side. I don't know. We're going to make it a really, really cool gaming room. That'll be really fun. So anyways, that's that all drywalled in, looking like a house. Over here, we have a ginormous Lego room. No, this is actually the master bedroom. It's extremely large. I'm going to walk to the corner of the room, take a U-turn here. And uh, it's got two windows here. Looks good. It is such a massive room. I think it's like, I don't know, I feel like 20-something feet long. Whatever. It's big. Next up we have on this side is going to be a hanging closet followed by a walk-in closet which is big dark and scary got a light don't worry but anyways yep that's that's that room needs a little bit of work got a lentil lentil closet I don't know is that what you call it a lentil 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 whatever it is and then our master bathroom which has a walk-in shower which will be all glass a door right here which will be kind of nice and then we'll have like a double vanity um on both sides and then a bathroom door for a toilet so anyways that that is pretty simple straightforward i know this is a little off the lego but giving you the whole walkthrough tour and then we have a laundry room on this side with another linen closet or whatever love the natural lighting and whatnot we do have another bathroom here a uh, smaller bathroom normal bathroom for when the little ones eventually do come out uh this will probably just be my office for the meantime and then we do have a nice room on this side that will be probably a guest bedroom for now and then they all do have closets and whatnot so anyways that is the upstairs let's go ahead and run run downstairs because now we get to go to the lego room so the most exciting part let's get it all right as we make a turn we'll have a door here walking down we will have oh my gosh it'll, this i'm thinking like one side will make all lego minifigs oh we'll do displays and whatnot but i'll leave some of the thoughts and opinions for you guys um but i really want to do a bunch of cool stuff down here guys especially just even walking down to it i want it to be all lego that way everybody knows when they come over they're walking into a lego room down here again a nice i would say pretty large landing over here if i go up oh my gosh this is so tall so maybe we'll hang the ultimate collector series venerator from there <laughs> i'm just kidding that would be very difficult all right as we walk on down i do have a little bit of water down here but you can blame the weather but anyways we are down here we do have the nine foot ceilings which has been pretty awesome definitely a great addition and if we take a look around this is a large space that's going to be a massive massive lego room so what i'm thinking is we have this very large cutout area and i'm thinking this becomes our studio area for live streams building lego reviews the whole kind of jazz and like i think we could do basically like wall, wall displays of lego on all sides 
And I think it would be pretty cool. So we'll do that. We'll have like a whole table set up in the middle here and we'll have that whole entire view. That'd be so, so cool. I think that is a great way to start things off. Of course, we are gonna have a massive like furnace and like a water heater and all that good stuff down here. So I'm thinking I'll like box that out from like maybe this column to, I can hardly see it, this column to like a door or something. Have a little excess room in there, but we'll box that out and then we'll make a Lego city or something on this whole section. So like a very large Lego city. I think that's a good idea. Or, or scratch that, we have this entire room over here to do a Lego city. Then on top of that, there is more that's very dark and can't see. I'm sorry, I don't have electric just up yet. Um, but this walks down and there's more to the basement on that side. Um, I'm thinking I might just use that for storage and stuff and this, the rest of this will, will be Lego. But uh, let me get some, here's some thoughts and opinions on that in the comments below. I, I really wanna do a very large Lego city and truthfully, I feel like that side actually might even be better. Uh, just because there is way, 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 way more space. Um, but I wanna make it like open in the middle or something that way I can actually walk in and work on it a little bit. But uh, I'll have to think of ideas for that. Regardless, on every single wall, I would like floor to wall displays around this whole entire area. That way we can display Lego sets in like a really decent manner. Now I know I have a really cool display of the Ultimate Collector Series Venator. <laughs> we have like that like glass box with the uh, light kit inside of it. So I have to think of a cool way to display that somewhere. Um, just because that's a massive, massive piece that um, we're going to have to put <laughs> on display to make it look good. But anyways, guys, that is a quick recap of our updates for the house update. It has really, really changed so much from the last one. I know it's, it might seem minimal, but for me, it's definitely a relieving experience, I would say. So let me know what you guys think in the comments below. I'm going to head out of here. It's really freezing. But if you want to see more updates, make sure to hit the subscribe button and let me know in the comments below. And if you want to see more, I'll be make sure <laughs> to give you guys more updates. And one other thing I wanted to throw in this video is, of course, just on how much of sheer amount of Lego we're going to have to move. I'm so sorry. This room is an absolute mess. But guys, this is going to be... Yeah, all under that is official sealed Lego sets. Everything under here is all <laughs> sealed Lego sets. Doesn't include my office upstairs, my storage room, and all the closets. So it's, yeah, bear with me. We're going to have a lot of Lego to do. One of the other things I mentioned early on is that I wanted to do a video of us, well, multiple videos of the whole moving process. So again, I'm always going to reiterate this. If you want to see that, those videos are coming. We're not moving just yet but it's coming very soon. So if you wanna see those, let me know in the comments below and uh, we'll see you in the next one.